Hi Tekla users, welcome to Tekla Tool and Tips video. This video is continuation to my last uploaded video. If you haven't seen it already, please check out the link in the card showing up on your screen. Here I am sharing some of the queries I am getting from the multiple users on my YouTube channels and another professional network. So in this video I will give the answer of their query. Come on the Tekla interface, go to the file and in the setting you can see that I have opened the default environment here in the application and component I am listing the macros extend exist you can see that this macro is not coming in the application and component because I am I have opened the default environment and it is only available in the US environment. The question is how I will import it in the default environment. So for that we will go to the Tekla structures environment. So press window R on your keyboard. Here I have pasted some link. See Tekla structures and whatever the version of Tekla you are using and go to the environment. Okay here you can see that I have common environment, default environment and US environment and because we all know that the extended access tool is only available in the US Imperial so go to that and come on the macros and because we are using the modeling macro we will go inside the modeling and write your tool name which you are searching for extend access elevation I am searching right now and here the tool is listing just copy the cs file and bmp file copy it cut it and go to the environment because I need to import it in my default environment I will go to the common environment here the macros is there modeling and paste my macro which I want ok so minimize it after just copying it it will not immediately come on your application and component to reflect in your system you need to restart your Tekla structures so here we go close it and save it so here I have restarted my Tekla and I am researching my tool after copying it in the common environment inside the macro folder so write it extend it just you can see that this tool is also available in my default environment so the process I have followed to bring this macro that is extend exist elevations from the US environment to the default environment you can use the same process to bring it on another environment that is you can transfer it in the Swedish environment, Denmark environment, Indian environment and whatever. The thing is you need to download the US environment in your system. Okay. Thank you for watching this video. Have a nice day.